This is a slow close-up of the left hand from Le Papillon number 13, Allegro, from Opus 50. It's out of this book, and I'm going to try to follow the fingering in this book as close as I can. And it's good to know that when we see fingerings on something like this, um, you can adapt it to your own um, abilities. Normally, fingering in a book that's official like this is worth at least trying to follow, and then you can make adjustments as you need to. So this will be, again, the left hand, and I'm going to try to follow it as close as I can to what's written in this edition of the song that I have here. So hopefully you'll be able to see everything. I'll try to move my hands around if the fingering isn't clear. So here's the beginning. <laughs> So I believe that was correct as far as this um, addition goes. Um, I will do that one more time and try to be a little bit more consistent so you can see how it flows. I'm still not going to play fast, but hopefully it'll sound a little bit more like what we want the song to sound like. Um, and I'll, again, I'll try to be as consistent as I can in following this exact instructions. Oops, there, I made a mistake. Okay, one more time. So hopefully that helps a little bit and brings some clarity as far as what fingers to use. And then on this hand, it's pretty consistent what I'm doing over here. I am just going... And then that roll and um, pattern goes through the whole thing, except for the very end where it goes... So here is the right hand. Hopefully this is helpful. Have fun.